Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Debt Prepare video. In today's episode, we're going to be working on a A1502 2015 again. Uh, this unit was mailed into us for an LCD repair. Let's go ahead and get into it. Of course, we're going to start by taking off the bottom panel here uh, by removing all the pentalobe screws. And next, the first thing we always do is disconnect this battery connector here. I'm going to take a spudger and lift it up. There we are. With the battery connected, we can now safely work on the unit. Since we're disconnecting the LCD, we're going to take off these two rubber covers on either side, unlatch the LCD connector, unplug it. We're going to start with the T5 screwdriver and remove the two uh, hinge points right here. And next we're going to use a T8 screwdriver and remove the three T8 screws on either hinge location. Now we're going to take our plastic spudger, unplug the Wi-Fi antennas, as well as the webcam here. Be careful with this connector when you're installing the new one. Uh, you can damage the entire connector, which would render your webcam microphone useless. There we are. All right, so the LCD is ready to be removed. So all we have to do is open up the unit. and pull the top case off. We're gonna set the bad LCD aside. Our new one here, remove the tape on it, holding down the various connectors. Uh, and if you guys are looking for parts or tools, check out the links below. If you're interested in a mail and repair similar to this one, or any data recovery service, check us out at techtep.com. We do it all every day. All right, so before we get this LCD ready for uh, installation. There's a couple things we have to do to it. Uh, we're going to take our pentalobe screwdriver here, go in one of these holes here, and just start bending uh, the hinges upward for installation. Uh, there's another way to do it, which I'm actually going to show you right now, versus closing the hinges. Uh, just tilt it up like this, take your T8 screwdriver and screw and connect one on either side. Right, the easiest way to do this process is to actually uh, seat it at the end of the table. So the table is right, the table is gonna be right here and this is hanging off the table. All right, now we can go ahead and close it and set it back down. Uh, one thing to note on this left hand side here, uh, when you are screwing these cables into place, there is a little uh, retention bracket right here. Uh, this guy has to go down before you screw these two in. Uh, these hold the Wi-Fi antennas in place. Uh, before we do any more screws though, I'm going to first plug in our Wi-Fi antennas. I'm going to start inside and work my way outward. Uh, you can go any way you find easiest. I have done this a lot and found inside out is typically the easiest way for me. All right, so we're going to take our uh, webcam microphone cable, run it underneath uh, this little bar here, plug it into place. Make sure that cable is all the way in or else you can get some glitching. Go back to our T8 screwdriver. Screw these into place here. We're going to take our rubber covers, put them back into place as well here. If you're ever confused on which one goes where, uh, this one actually has a little cutout on this side. It goes on the left hand side here. Take our bottom cover and screw it back in using our pentalobe screwdriver. 
All right, so this is gonna wrap up today's video. Uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and with the help of the community, I will be sure to assist you. If you saw any parts or tools you need in the video, check us out at techdep.com or click the link below for mail-in repair. We'll see you guys in the next episode.